Hi guys, it's Megan. Today on Bake Me Happy, we're going to make banana bread. Before we do anything, we need to preheat our oven to 180 degrees Celsius. The equipment we will be needing today is one bread pan with greased and lined with baking paper, an electric mixer and a paddle attachment. The ingredients we'll be, we will be using is one teaspoon of bicarb soda, half a cup of butter, half a cup of sugar, one cup of self-raising flour, vanilla extract, three tablespoons of milk, two eggs and three very ripe bananas. Our first step is to cream the butter and the sugar. Next we need to add in two beaten eggs. Next we need to add one level teaspoon of bicarb soda into three tablespoons of milk and stir it. Then we add it to the mixture. Next we need to add one cup of self-raising flour and three very, really ripe bananas. Now if you notice these bananas are actually quite brown but the more ripe your bananas are, the moister your cake will be. So we'll add these in. Then we just need to add a dash of vanilla extract. Then we need to pour the batter into the cake pan and cook it for 30 to 35 minutes. Now we're just going to bake it for 30 to 35 minutes. So while that's baking in the oven, we're going to make a really simple vanilla icing. We're going to start with about a cup of icing sugar, two tablespoons of milk and some vanilla extract. So we'll just start with adding our tablespoons of milk and mix that together. Alright, so once it gets to this consistency, we're just going to add a dash of vanilla extract. And mix that in. Alright, so the timer just went off, so we're going to check to see if it's completely cooked through. Alright, you can see it's still on the stick, so we'll put it back in for another five minutes. Alright, the timer's just gone off, so we'll check it again. That's much better. We just need to leave this until it's completely cooled. So I let the banana cake cool in the tin for about 10 minutes and then I transferred it to a cooling rack and now that it's completely cooled to the touch, it's ready to ice. So we made our icing a while ago, so I'm just gonna mix that all together again. And it's as easy as drizzling over the top. Alright, so here we have the finished banana cake. Thanks very much for watching. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you next time on Bake Me Happy.